Hello, I welcome you all to your own channel MSK Learning. Now in this video we will see the exact differential equations, right? So any equation which is in the form of m dx plus n dy is equal to zero is a type of differential equation, exact differential equation. So you cannot say directly that whether the given differential equation is an exact or not. So you have to check for for the exactness, right now. So we'll see that how to check the exact differential equation and what are the working rule to get the general solution. So here we have let m f of uh, m of x y dx plus n of x y dy is equal to zero be a first order and first degree differential equation. So which is in the form of m dx like x plus y into dx or you can say cos x plus cos y into dy is equal to zero which has obviously it is the first order and first degree so differential equation where m and n are real valued function for the sum x comma y then the equation m dx plus n dy it's said to be an exact differential equation if there exists a function of f such that though f by though x is equal to m means whatever the function is given that function we have to differentiate with respect to x that we call m and when, when we differentiate with respect to y we call it as a n. So now that any equation which is in the form of m dx plus n dy it's said to be an exact differential if this equation is though f by though x is equal to m and though f by though y is equal to n and then this should be equal. So now we can say condition for exactness. So the given differential equation m dx plus n dy is equal to 0 to be exact if dou m by dou y is equal to dou n by dou x. Now there are the working rule that once the given differential equation in the form of m dx plus n dy is become exact then how to find their exact uh, how to find their general solution. So there are the working rules that first of all that you have to check whether the given if differential equation that first order first degree equation is exact or not. So dou m by dou y is equal to dou n by dou x means m and n you have to differentiate with y and x respectively and if their partial differentiation differential is equal it means that the given differential equation is an exact. Next then we have to consider any uh, function phi of m of x y plus h of y or directly you can say the general solution of the given equation is phi of x y is equal to m x y dx plus the terms which is independent of x right in n into dy that uh, what whatever the integration will get that there is a general solution or simply you can write this you can remember that once the given differential equation is become exact then you have to general solution is m of dx that whatever the m you have you have to integrate with respect to dx and n dy but n terms you have to take which is independent of x so in this n you need not to take any value which contain x right which is free from the x that value you should take and then you have to integrate is equal to constant there is a general solution so we'll see one working example and then it will be very very clarified that how to find the exactness of a given differential equation and also their general solution so let's start so here we go that the question on the screen <coughs> solve the differential equation 2x minus y plus 1 into dx plus 2y minus x minus 1 into dy. So it's very simple that this equation is in the form of something like that m dx plus n dy where m is what? m is 2x minus y plus 1 and n is nothing but the 2y minus x minus 1. Right? So first of all we can say that solution solution the given equation is given equation is what is 2x minus y plus 1 into dx plus 2y minus x minus 1 into dy is equal to 0 right and also you can say this is of the form this is in the form of in the form of what 
m d x plus n d y is equal to zero. So you can write it that also m d x plus n d y is equal to zero. Let's compare that with d x. What are the coefficient? Two x minus y plus one, and with d y this. So you can say therefore the m is equal to two x minus y plus one, and your n is equal to two y minus x minus one. Is it or not? Now then we have to check for the exact whether this is differential equation is an exact or not right so now we can find do m by uh, do y and do n by do x so first of all we can say do m by do y so what is that do by do y m is equal to what this one 2x minus y plus 1 all right so this is what you have a zero y differentiation is what M minus y is minus 1 it is zero so here you can say minus 1 right now again you can find do n by do x do n by do x so we can say do by do x n is what 2y minus x minus 1 we are differentiating with respect to the y so it is 0 its differentiation is minus 1 and its differentiation is 0 so it is what minus 1 so now we can check whether it is exact or not so here we can say since do m by do y is equal to do n by do x both the values is minus 1 minus 1 so therefore the given you can say the given differential equation is an exact right the given given differential equation is an exact right now after checking the exactness we will find the general solutions right so now we can sign right we can write the general solution general solution simply general solution is what the general solution is nothing but in the form of integration of m dx all right plus integration of n dy is equal to constant right but this n is what free from the x right so we can say only uh, those term which uh, do not contain x right so you can say those here it, in short you can write those terms which don't contain which don't contain x right so now check it that m is equal to what m is equal to 2x minus y plus 1 whole will take but in x 2y minus x minus 1 so x we don't con means x we should not take why because it is a condition that while we find the general solution you should not take the value which is having x so only you have a n will take the 2y minus 1 right so you can write it here that this is equal to m is equal to integration of uh, 2x 2x minus y minus well sorry plus 1 right into dx plus integration of n dy n is equal to actually 2y minus x minus 1 but we don't take x so we can say 2y minus 1 right into dy is equal to constant so let's integrate this so its integration is what x square by 2 and 2 2 will get cancelled so it is x square dx it will be dx integration is x so it will be minus xy dx plus x right so plus x plus again this 2y integration is what y square by 2 2 2 will get cancelled that is y square dy's integration is minus y is equal to c all right so this is how we can say the equation so now simplify you can x square right plus uh, y square minus x y uh, plus x minus y and uh, plus x y is equal to c so this is your required general solution right so this is how you can find the given uh, differential equation if it is in the form of m dx plus n dy okay thank you